When we first take a glance at this piece of JavaScript code, we might think that there is nothing wrong with it and when the function get object is invoked, it will return the object with the id property. However, when we run the snippet, we can see that the returned value is actually undefined. This happens because there is a subtle issue here related to automatic semicolon insertion, better known as ASI in JavaScript. ASI automatically inserts semicolons at the end of certain lines if they are omitted. For example, in this case, ASI inserts a semicolon after the return keyword treating the subsequent lines as separate statements. Since it's an empty return, get object actually will return the undefined value, terminating the return statement prematurely and the object below it will be ignored because it will be seen as an unrelated statement. Now, ASI is also true for other JavaScript keywords like throw, break and continue. So what's your takeaway here? It's best to include semicolons explicitly in your code to avoid any unexpected behavior. Hope you guys learned something new today and subscribe to the channel for more such content.